That's gonna look pretty good, actually. I got tired of listening to the music on a cheap Bluetooth speaker that I bought at Ross, and I decided to drop 200 bones and get me a Boss soundbar for the side-by-side. -side. 500 watts, peak power, and it's got the remote aux and USB connections. I think this one's gonna be a good one. Check it out, see how it does, and get this thing installed. So this sound bar is, you know, metal and you can, I mean, you can hear that metal, you know, it's, a lot of times it's really hard to convey that, of what kind of material that, I mean, this is almost like, dad says it's steel, I don't know if it's like a type of galvanized or it's aluminum or, but I mean, it's a good quality metal and that's the important thing is, you know, you don't have to have steel, it have to be, you know, 420 stainless steel, but as long as it's a good quality metal, this is going to be a really nice sound bar. This is the speaker that I was using, the Clazo Bomb. And, you know, you can hear it's pretty good. Yeah, when the motor's not on. And uh, let me switch to the Boss. Four speakers, two tweeters, 500 watts, max power. the difference between a Bluetooth speaker and the Boss BRT26A 500 watt soundbar for your side by side. Love this thing. I have the Pioneer 700 four seater and it's got a top speed of 42 44 miles per hour and I can hear this at full volume just fine now this isn't going to be something that you know you can hear for miles around but for you and all your passengers you're able to hear this at full top speed and that's just on the highway so when you get on the trails you're really not going 40 miles an hour you know the average speed on the trails is you know 20 to maybe 30 miles an hour if that, depending on if you're trying to navigate the terrain. So with that being said, this is a great option for only $200 to get you a nice sound bar that has the ability to plug into your cigarette lighter and also comes with the adapters. So that way you can get it plugged into your battery if that's how you wanna operate your speaker. For $200 though, this was a fabulous deal. And if, if you guys are looking for a sound bar, for your side-by-side -side power sports or anything that's got, you know, these tubes on there. This is what you're gonna wanna look at. At least look at the option. $200 allows you to be able to, say, use the other $200 that you would spend on a really nice, fancy sound bar. And, you know, it's 
not going to give you that much better quality unless, you know, you're buying one that's a sound bar and it's got, you know, six extra speakers that hook over here and hook over there and hook over there. Okay, maybe you're going to get a little better sound, but for the value, this sound bar is going to allow you to spend your money on other things while having quality sound for only $200. Hope you guys enjoyed this video.